no. Get the hell out of here. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, that I, stuff I, I cut people. my Get finger. Oh my god. No I cut my finger. <laughs> All right, so I love to take this middle right here. You take a little tiny triangle right here. Okay, you see how it's a little uneven here? Just one, two, three, four. And you're seeing an imaginary line right here, even though I'm going up on it. This is little peaks. So good. Now, anything that's a little more, you, you're looking to see, is it too thick there? But I, I like it, so I'm not going to cut into it right yet. Now, right here, I'm going to come down because I want this to angle around her face. I always think like this. See her eyebrow? Where her eyebrow is right there, you want to start angling this hair down. You want always a benchmark. See right there, that comes straight down to here. That is your imaginary line. You're not cutting it to my fingers. I'm cutting it from here to here. See that? So watch. Easy peasy. Now look, it's too straight there. I want it to be softer. So I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna just cut little pieces. And this will flip back beautifully because she likes this and then she likes this to all come forward and then I'll do her other side but first I just want to put a little more form at 18 see her muff over here too see this piece it just doesn't fall right on her face and we want the Jacqueline Smith haircut for her because that's what she loves she likes it nice and soft and then she's got like a muff here too it's like not blended this should be very beautiful nice and gentle cascading down to her length She does have layers in here, but we're going to check those layers too. And Paula, when you have a good haircut, how long does it last? Oh, well, I don't know, months, I don't know. We, uh, it it just, lasts it's so much longer. I don't know how to answer this question. <laughs> yeah. That's funny. Right? right? Because when you as long as you're following through with the haircut, it, it makes me happy. Like every it's few just, months I come and you blend it right and it's easy peasy yeah. right you never have a bad hair day yeah. listen your hair is your crown you never have a bad hair day when you pay for a great haircut but they need to know what they're doing right a lot of times hairdressers don't understand like how to do the angles right how to do layers they don't teach the old school way the way I learned and I also did bumble and bumble global artists that teach volume in hair that so it's what I love the, yes, the volume Okay, now look, right here. Now I'm gonna do both because I can do that. Otherwise, you might have to cut it first and then put the texture in there. I do both, just so you know, because I'm experienced. I'm gonna grab this again. Now look at, look at where her eyebrow is. See how I start to angle that right where her eyebrow is? Parallel to that eyebrow, this piece. And then you check it. Check, 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 check. Check, 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 check. Good. Now I need to get that piece right here. Now you're gonna really see this. And we just get a clip. All right, I'm gonna show you with a razor, but I gotta make it a little more wet. But in the direction I want to go, now look at my razor. I'm gonna just slide layer this straight down. I'm etching it out. Now I'm gonna pull it out right there. From here to here is where I'm gonna get it to go. Cut it. Now look at, I need a little more right there. All right, I'm gonna use my scissors just because <clears throat> I need to like, her hair is curly and out of control a little bit. So I'm gonna actually get in there. I would need to do a little bit more. And a lot of times you think of a C, like a C comes out and around, right? If we 
took a little C, the next piece too is gonna come down more. It's gonna actually frame her face going down. And now I'm gonna look at it again. I wanna just cut into it a little bit more. I wanna make sure that this piece right here is angled correctly. Cause you've seen how it didn't lay well before. All right, now I'll take the next section. And basically I'm just doing a face frame, that's it. Super easy, man, keep it easy. Now, this is the other thing I wanna show you. I'm not bringing it forward here, but I could. All right, I'm really just bringing it down to where it wants to live. So I'm putting my hands in there, right here. See all that extra hair? That's the problem. I don't want you to keep your head straight. I oh, know. Yeah. Don't help. <laughs> all right, here we go. Now look at all that. I have to cut this off right here. All that is extra weighed down hair. So I'm going to show you from the bottom up. I'm combing this all down right here. Here we go. Right there. Here in the back. I just want to Okay, now I'm gonna get the next part. Now basically, what you're doing is you're dividing a straight middle from her nose all the way down the mohawk to bring this all the way forward and see how it, see where it's laying. You're just gonna always check it first. Oops, sorry. And she's got fairy hair in there. <laughs> People love fairy hair, I know. Everywhere I go. Is that your earring? There is an earring. Okay, she's got a little earring in there. You gotta be careful too. You don't pull people's earrings out. Hello. <laughs> Sorry. Don't beat up your customer either, just saying. We gotta layer her back to. Um, I was gonna say, I like the way your hair was okay. fuller in the back. Yeah. Okay. The layers in the back of your hair as well. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Get the hell out of here. Don't oh, I'm sorry. Don't forget that stuff. I, I cut my get finger. Oh, my God. I cut my finger. <laughs> you crazy girl. Don't want that. Yeah. yeah. Don't mind me having a little pack. I'm going to get a baby. <laughs> need stitches? No, I don't need stitches, but we got baby shark, shark, shark band-aids. Sometimes you can cut yourself. Baby shark, shark, shark. Oh, look at my little girl. Isn't she pretty? I like her. I love her blonde hair. Isn't that cool? I'm going to layer her hair one day just to show you guys layers on that too. All right, we got my shark, shark, shark baby. All right, all right, yeah. Paul, we're ready. Sorry, I didn't mean to bleed on you. Oh, you almost got it. Uh, right there, man, get that piece. Now I'm pulling it down. Now I'm checking it. Listen, remember that straight down, up here, right here. That's her length. This has to come off right here. And just soften that a little bit so it's all even. There we go. Oh my gosh, so much better! Don't turn your head. You can't turn your head. Burp over here. Yeah, that's gonna look so so good. You gotta make sure it's all blended. Check it right there. Keep keep blending it until it's like nice and even and blended perfect it's gonna cascade all the way down now we're gonna do her other side okay you see it now right look at this hair now let me show you real quick just look at that no no okay now listen she's got her own curls but look at the difference when when we blow dry this it's gonna literally cascade down she's got pretty uncontrolled waves uncontrollable <laughs> waves and we just need to put more power in this and then this is gonna be nice and smooth coming down. 
She doesn't really like the flips. You know I like the flips, but we like the 80s, right? That, what was Charlie's Angels? When was that? Uh, eight, I don't remember. Charlie's eight, Angels. I remember like them. The 70s? Yeah, 78, 80. I think it started. Okay. Okay, okay here we go. We're going to... Here we go. See it? The disconnect. Look at that bad piece right there. So now, now this will be easier for me to do actually with my razor on this side. And listen, you can do whatever you want, whatever is more comfortable, whatever feels good. One side you do with a scissor, the next side you do with a razor. It's okay. It's just cutting the hair. I want to blend this going down. Use your imagination. I'm getting all that off right there. Nice. Now I'm going to take the next section. See, it's looking good. All that right there. And trust me, that little bit is a huge difference. And it's not much hair, right? No. <laughs> not at all. Now Amazing. I'm just going to use the data because I use a lot of the fun that you've seen. Although that'll weigh your hair down too because you got some crazy curls. Yeah. <laughs> Whew, those curls are like, want to do what they want. And I'm just wondering if... Look at... See how nice that is? What? If I let my hair go curly with the way that drop was, it didn't match. So I, I like wearing my hair curly. But yeah, you can. So this way it'll make it... Yes. So you can more, wear it curly too. Okay. Thanks. Listen, you could do it straight. It looks stunningly beautiful. Right there. You see that extra weight? Listen, I'm going to do my scissor now. Because I always wear my hair straight. And sometimes I like to wear it curl. But you couldn't. No. Because it just was out of control. But it we would still blow her top. Ooh, okay. Now I'm dividing that in the middle. Okay, let me see. And now you check, 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 check. Grab those two pieces, bring it right in the middle. See, this is a tiny, tiny bit, a little longer right there. See it? Right there. And I'm gonna grab it again. You wanna make it even still a little tiny bit? A little bit, tiny bit. Come on here. That's it right there. And see, you can see where it was too. Here we go, grab it and make sure her nose is the center. There you go, you're checking it. Perfect now, perfect, perfect, perfect. And then you check, like you grab the same pieces from each spot and just check that hair, make sure it's nice and even. And this side I might have to do it just a tiny bit more, I feel like, just a little. Alright, now guys, you know, I'm going to turn you around, Paul, we're going to do the beach ball. What? Oh, my little kitty. Hi. Hi, little legend. This is little legend. And he loves to get his hair, he loves to be around us when we're doing the haircut. We are animal lovers, if you cannot tell. Little legend. My little hand to me gives a little cry and says, please love me, love me, love me. Love the way he's I know, isn't it? He's like a little... He's a little legend, called Leaping Legend. He flips backwards, chases a feather. I love you. And he loves the dogs. The dogs love him too. <laughs> hi, handsome. You want to say hi? Yeah, he's good. See how cute? Love them. So, all right, now we're doing the, you guys know, beach ball. I want you to turn around. We'll just turn, we can spin, sorry. Okay, here we go. Now. What is it? Oh, that's the little fairy, fairy hair. hair. That's why. It's pulling a little. So let me show you something here. She definitely does not have a lot of layers here. All right. So how can we tell? So I'm going to kind of take you sideways right here because this is where I'm going to really show you. You guys know you got the round circle of a beach ball right at the top of the head. Section out. 
and take the first piece down of the Mohawk. All right, so that looks good. See that right there? That's pretty good. I'm just gonna just touch it a little. And you can see like, I'm sure it just went right into that. Yeah, it was nice right there. So now this is where it's gonna have a hard time. Okay, we probably gotta start cutting this off because it's just too heavy for the bottom part. Now, look at right there. This extra right here, even though it doesn't seem like it'd be a lot, it the little things, guys, it's the little things that make such a difference. So that's number one. And then we got number two. And I am gonna cut into that a little bit more. I'm gonna definitely notch. And then I'm gonna turn you around, hold on. As soon as I notch this next piece, I'm just gonna show them. Hold on, I just gotta wet it a little more. Go. I need a little bit more right here, taking this number two. Right there's the extra weight. See that? Now you can cut it that way, okay? You can cut it, and then you get back in there, and then you point cut, point cut. Soften that because it lays so soft that you don't see any ledges. When you cut a straight line, a lot of times you can see ledges. That's the whole point why I point cut so much and I texturize, because I want volume. And even if we want to leave our top this long, we could as long as we texturize, it will still be lighter and it will have way more volume. All right, so that was section one, section two. Now I'm on section three. You can never get lost if you have a pattern. And you could do a way faster haircut because you know what you're doing. Let me show you how I, I'm gonna turn the other way notch it okay a little more Paula right there okay look at the bend you're going over that bend this is where I want her most fullness so I'm gonna notch little tiny tiny pieces I want to put this down hold up for a second just little baby baby pieces and that's it and that will instantly make it voluminous right it'll start pulling up even if you want to take this this way Look where the bend is and just over it. Just cut little tiny pieces. And instantly, it'll put volume at that top. That fairy hair is... That fairy hair is painted, yeah. Huh? <laughs> just a little. This is all extra weight. I'm gonna get in here, I need to take some weight out of this hair. So when it curls up, she's gonna have beautiful cascading curls that will look so healthy and happy because curls need friends. Mm -hmm. All right, now I wanna do a little bit here too, even though it's a bottom. I want more fullness on that very bottom. Otherwise it was like one length down here too. So now we're putting that volume in. That was one, two, three. Now I'm gonna go to two. I'm gonna, you know how I do the little notching. Now I'm always bringing the section where it lifts. Okay, I'm not over directing. I really rarely over direct hair. Rarely, rarely, rarely. Over directing means this. I push this hair over here or I push this hair over here. That's over directing. I don't do that. I put it right where it lifts, right where it's coming out of the scalp. And what I do is, so even though I'm on number two, I take a little piece of number one and I pull it into number two and that's where I cut the hair. So I can over direct that little part to number two because I'm always staying in the center of number two. All that extra weight right down there, that's what was making it too heavy looking on that bottom. And it's not cutting from her length. Her hair is still long. You understand? But now at least it has curls all evenly throughout. Now I'm going to number th three on the other side. See all that extra hair? You guys are seeing. 
Right there. I just want a notch. Uh, excuse me, you gotta get out of the hair, little mister. All right, now we're gonna. Now you can. I'm gonna let her stay here because I'll be in front of her, but I'm doing her let her right side. Okay, I always am in front of them on the right, and then when I turn around, I'll be up behind her doing the, the other side. But I won't have to do much here. I want to know if you know that answer why. Come on, let's see who's the winner out there. You're a winner, you've always been a winner, you'll always be a winner. And go like this, I'm a winner. I've always been a winner and I'll always be a winner. You're a winner for right now and you're a winner the day you were born and you'll always be a winner until you get to heaven. So why is this, I'm gonna not need much? Because I angled the whole thing around her face. So that whole side is already pulled forward and layered. So that's why, so whoever got that, give yourself a big pat on the back for paying attention and using your thinking mind. Listen, it's so good. Knowledge is power. Learning is your superpower. And thinking is your superhero power. That's what we need. We need superhero powers using our thinking mind when we're cutting hair. Just saying. See, it's all done already. But I am going to notch it just a little bit more. Just needs a tiny, tiny bit. But she needs that notching to make it fuller. And I'm going to go in there just a couple places on the top to even just do it a little bit more so that it has power and volume. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to check it. If you cut it vertical, you're going to check it horizontal. Easy peasy to remember. Wow, that looks so beautiful. When she wears it curly, it's just gonna naturally go right into place. Okay, now I want you to turn around. Look how nice this side is already. All it beautifully even symmetry, right? You want it to just be natural and look so perfect, natural. And this is how you do the beach ball haircut. Farrah Fawcett. You know, little changes here and there, but it's really similar. Maybe you over direct a little bit if you were going to do something different for the far faucet, or you pull it forward a little bit more and you angle it, but, but not much. Oh, that, that I need to definitely do. See that extra piece right there? And I'm coming behind. And this would be number four on her left side. Now you check a piece from the top. Right there, that's extra weight right there. See that piece? Hold on. Right here. So I didn't have to do much, but it was nice to see that I definitely had to do more on this side. Always texturizing, always past that little um, bend. And I'm bringing this a little towards her face. So this is the only time that I really over direct. Everywhere else, I really don't. All right, now let me show you how to check this hair. I'm gonna turn her this way, okay? So you're gonna see a little angle going upward, right? So we check from her bangs, mohawk. Okay, I'm gonna turn your head this way. Right there, I gotta get that off. Right there, now I wanna texture that more. That little tiny thing will make it so much better. Now if I didn't check that, it would have a little drag to it. I'm just texturizing, cause it's really pretty good. Yep, pretty good. Now I'm just texturizing, cause this is all her top. It needs more, it needs volume. Now take this whole side. Those are all little pieces coming out from her texture. Great. Now I take the other side. Right there. 
And the only thing I need to do, because I can't do it that way, I have to come around this way and notch. So watch, look at the bend. Listen, if you don't have a hairstylist that knows how to do this, let them watch my video. Share my video with your hairstylist and ask them to watch it. It takes a good 90 days to imprint something new. Through neuroscience and psychology, that's what it says. So listen, I've trained so many young girls how to do this beach ball layer haircut and they've all become successful. So just so you know, you could become successful too. You just have to believe in yourself and you gotta practice. Practice, practice, practice makes improvement. More practice and practice, practice makes progress. And more practice, practice, practice makes a pro. So start practicing, get those mannequin heads and practice. You're gonna be an expert at layers if you do it this way. I'm gonna pull it all up. Right there, that little tiny, tiny piece right there. And I just wanna put a little more texture right here. I feel like it's so thick. Try not to get her fairy hair. Mm -hmm. All right, now let me show you the back. <laughs> oh my gosh, that looks so good. Just take it up like a ladder. Oh, gotta get that spot. One, pull it up. Two, pull it up. And you guys know, man, you gotta keep that mindset strong. You gotta keep your mind and your body strong. It all goes together. And look at, I'm checking it. I just need to do a little bit more on this side. But it's very balanced. It's not like, it doesn't have to be perfectly even, it has to be balanced. It's not like way off, it's just, just that little smidge. And it's nice and soft, so it will be gorgeous. All right guys, now we're gonna blow dry. Are you ready? Ready? The 80s girls. The 80s girls. These are the real 80s girls. Come on, we gotta like flip it over and flip it over. Me and my daughter one night, we had so much fun. It was called Dance Night. And we just did the electric guitar. We just mm -hmm. how do like, you know, the 80s. What's up? She's got eyes of <laughs> the bluest <laughs> sky. And if they don't have rain. <laughs> okay. All right. Listen, enough of that. All right, we're doing. This is um, Just a lot of smooth and shine, smooth and shine. <laughs> smooth me now. We're gonna get those curls under control. But look how pretty if we just put curl cream in there. Davines curl cream is the bomb. Aveda curl cream is the bomb. There's certain curl creams that are just so good. And literally, look how pretty. We didn't even put product in it yet. I want you to turn around. Look at how nice and symmetric all those curls are gonna be. All super cascading. Beautiful symmetry in that hair. Now I'm gonna put this um, smooth and shine in her ends because I want volume on her top and I am gonna put mousse on the rest of her hair too because I need to control this curl because she wants me to blow it out. She doesn't want it all flippy. She wants it really like the Jacqueline Smith blow dry because you know I like to do flips and she's like, no, I don't want the flips. So we're gonna use this one. Aveda Invati, Advanced Thickening Foam. Okay, now you know, listen, I use some one, two, three. You know what they did a test on this? It was the only one that didn't disintegrate. <laughs> I'm not doing the yingling commercial. There we go. <laughs> She's just having a yingling because she wants a little yingy. A little yingy. <laughs> yingy, yangy, yingling. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, I'm doing a yingling commercial. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Now we're putting that volume on the top. Listen, I want those bangs. Those bangs are stubborn. We gotta tell them what to do. It's like a stubborn child. You have to make it submissive, okay? Now I need more. That was just the top, those three pumps. One, two, three, three more, All right? I'm gonna put it in and then I'm gonna take it because this is gonna be the spot that I need to really hold it the most. And now I'm gonna put it all in, especially right here. I want volume there. Put it all in nice and even. You can even brush it through. This way you know everything is evenly in there, distributed. All right. Here we go. And I'm gonna use my shark, because it's at my house, and I like the shark. It's quick and easy. I'm gonna flip her over. I'm gonna use my fingers first to dry it. 
Oh yeah, I can take my band-aid off now. See? Just so you know. Miracle. Yeah. Whoever got that, we'll talk about that another time. All right, now, for you guys that know about brushes, what brush am I gonna use on top? If I want smaller curls, I'm using the small one. Now I want height, so I'm gonna use the smaller one for the top, and the rest, I'm gonna use the bigger one. Just so you know. Look how nice that is. And just so you guys know, my wall over here that she's staring at, it says inspire and create, visualize your highest self and start showing up as her. Right? See the good, good in all things. Imagine, imagine, all you have to do is imagine. Imagination is greater than knowledge. Don't forget that. And then building my empire, endless, endless. My potential is endless. I am enough. A little, little legend, enough. Our little kitty, he cries because he wants my attention. And then actually, I can. And I'm going to say, actually, you can. Practice, 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 and you'll be a pro at this. When you set hair and you really need one piece, just be patient and allow it to cool off so that it will literally go back. Well, that piece is not working, so I have to just do that over there, but normally it works. <laughs> Hold on. One more thing, a haircut's never done until after the blow dry. You gotta check it again after the blow dry. See, is there anything more that you could do? Do I have to get any more pieces? Is it too thick somewhere? You're checking it out, you're looking. I wanna blow this a little straighter. And one more thing I want to remind you, the higher the hair, the closer to God. Just saying. <laughs>
so now I want you to look, look at how pretty. Right, we might need to do this a little shorter just so that it has more volume, but I want her to look at it first to make sure because we could just tease that too before it's too short. And you know, you want my pick. You get your pick, you take it here. You just kind of go right into it and then it'll make it higher. See, just go into it. I got that lot great. <laughs> I thought you were teasing me. Whatever. No, we did tease it. Pinky Tuscan. No, I'll oh. take leather. Oh, leather. <laughs> All right, you got it rolling? We're live. All right, so look, oh. you just pull some pieces. Right? Behind the scenes. Okay, so look it. And you want to make sure, right? Like, I could just do a little bit more right there. Take your razor, just ever so slightly. Just ever so slightly, just little pieces. Yeah, that looks great. Okay, now I want you to turn. Look at how good this hair looks. Keep going. Keep going. Good. All the way, all the way, all the way. Good, there we go. All right, let me show you too. I'm gonna do a little hairspray on this side. And yeah, Duke is not a happy camper with thunder. Oh, sorry. He starts to get scared. Oh, sorry. He starts shaking. My little Duker. All right, my friend. Oh, Ta-da! shake it. I know, he'll shake no. The handsome boy. He don't like the the okay. thunder. Okay. You can stay right here. You want to see him shaking our poor handsome? Oh, no. Look at my sad. poor handsome. Really? That's. Oh, do you give him anything to calm him down? I'll give him like a little CPD. Yes. Yeah. It's my right. right, buddy. Oh, he's really scared. He's really scared. I didn't eat ever see this. It's okay. Look, Stella feels bad too. Oh, you're oh, gonna take care okay. of him. It's okay. I gotta put the fans on loud. I gotta like make sure all the right. TV's on Let's loud. Let's go take care of the pop. All right, we're all done. Oh, you poor sweet thing. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. All right, cut. So you have to kind of like. Yes, yes. Yeah. It is. Good. Look how much better that haircut is. Now you check it all, right? Check, 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 make sure it's like even like thickness wise, everything. And you know what? It looks really, really good. All right, now let's put a little spray in there. You gotta do a whole turnaround. <clears throat> Keep going. Keep going. Yay! Did you see it yet? Thank you. Paula, how do you like your hair? I'm very happy with the cut and the way it, it, the layers are and the shape around my face. Just, Kimmy, you always do a great job with my hair for the years you've been cutting my hair. Thank you. Here we go. Look Thank at you. Cool haircut. Thank you. Woo I hope you like it, everybody.